Hello all, in this video we will see how to create a business object universe. However, before creating an actual universe, we will see the report requirement first. So our reports are like this. We will be creating two reports. Uh, first is the employment history report, uh, which will be having employee ID and uh, history of its uh, employment like uh, employment start date end date and uh, respective job ID and the department ID. In the second report, we will have actual employment details. Uh, it, it will be sh uh, showing uh, latest employee records uh, which will contain uh, employee ID, employee names, its respective hire date, salary, city, state and so on. So uh, basically both, are the, both these reports are related with the employee history or the employee information. So let's start creating the universe now. Uh, we'll create a new project. Uh, employment report uh, we'll first create a relational connection so that we can import the tables respective tables from HR schema Play report DB we'll create the Oracle connection DB connection got created. We'll create a data foundation layer now. Employee report data layer. We'll import the respective tables from the HR schema. Insert tables. So countries, departments, employees, jobs, jobs history, location and the seventh one is region. We'll join these seven tables all together. So first is the employee. So department ID is a foreign key to the departments table. So departments is the master table which will have department ID as a primary key. So obviously the cardinality between these two will be many to one. Similarly location will get joined to location master table. So location ID will be the primary key in the location master table. Again the cardinality will be many to one. Similarly country ID will get joined with the country table so country id is the primary key in the country table so again the relationship or the cardinality between these two will be many to one region id okay. region id will get mapped with region id of the country table so in region id at region table is a primary key so cardinality in this case will be one to many job ID will get mapped with jobs table cardinality will be many to one again the job ID here will get mapped with this job ID cardinality will be one to many employee ID will get mapped with the employees table the cardinality will be many to one Sorry, yeah, that's fine. And the department ID will get joined with department master table. So again, this will be many to one. We'll save these joins or the universe which we have created. Now we'll now our relationship is done. But before uh, migrating the, migrating this universe to 
द लोकल डी बी और टू द लोकल स्पेस विल फर्स्ट डिटेक्ट द लूप्स इफ देर आर एनी सो देर इज अ लूप बिटवीन डिपार्टमेंट्स एंड हिस्ट्री जॉब हिस्ट्री टेबल सो टू अवॉइड द अवॉइड द लूप विल मेक वन ऑफ द ज्वाइन एज अ शॉर्टकट ज्वाइन not this one the join between job history and the departments we'll make this join as a shortcut join save it and we'll again detect the loops so we will still have we have one loop that is between employee and job history again so we'll make this join also as a shortcut join we'll again save it and we'll detect the loops yes now our universe is fine there are no loops we'll arrange okay so we have all together seven tables there are two shortcut joins and there is no loop so our universe is fine we'll create the business layer now new business layer employee report checks select the foundation layer will do not want to create folders and objects automatically will create those manually by our own as per our requirement so we will first create the objects which are based on the master master tables so first will be the jobs job id job title maximum salary minimum salary we'll create objects for departments department id department name we do not want manager id in the departments folder also we do not want location id so location id location related information will come from the location master table location id street address postal city Street provence country code we do not want in the location de location folder. We'll bring country information from the country folder. Region ID we do not want. We'll bring region ID from region master table. Delete oh yeah that's fine. So we have information from one two three four five. There is one, two, three, four, five. We'll bring in the transactional data or the employees data. So employee ID, first name, last name, department ID. We do not want from the employees table. Manager ID. That's fine. And the remaining information related to job history. So employee ID we already have from the employees table. So we do not want it from job history. Delete it. Similarly, the job ID and the department table we already have. We'll delete that also. So our objects got are created, but in this case, all the objects are or none of the object object is of major. So we'll change some objects to the major type, like uh, salary has to be of. major change it to some similar the uh, similarly the commission percent has to be of major type we'll create it as none so most of the objects are of, uh, are of type dimension except the salary and percentage from employees transactional data so we'll just double click we do not want it some by default so our universe is created so in the next video we'll see how to create a report based on the universe which we have just created but before doing that we'll just migrate this universe to our local folder so let's publish
just publish this report or universe to our local folder check integrity select all next so we'll be storing this universe at c business objects and universe folder so it's saying that universe published got success universe got published successfully we'll just validate so we have this universe got saved locally thanks for watching this video